What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel and this is my very first speaking vlog. Like speaking and not like voice over. And I decided to vlog now because I'm going to Tokyo with my family and I don't know, so raming content lang magagawa dun. Like expect a lot of fashion, shopping, vintage shopping. We're going to a flea market, like the biggest flea market. And yeah, I hope you guys would enjoy this first speaking vlog. And I'll just see you guys back in when we arrive in our Airbnb. Kasi medyo mahirap mag-vlog pag dala-dala yung mga maleta. But yeah, see you guys in Tokyo. Sorry, hindi na ako nakapag-update yesterday but I'm here in Japan and I haven't done an update because when we arrived at the Airbnb, diretso na kami umikot like around our Airbnb and nakapag-shopping na ako sa GU and sayang. I wanted to vlog about it but I forgot to bring my stuff there but it's okay and this is our official first day in Tokyo and we are going to... Harajuku and Shibuya so let's go hey guys I'll just do an outfit breakdown first my cardigan is from cos my long sleeve is from SM thrifted pants then the bag is Nin and Yang a local brand and then New Balance 550s Hi, we're here at Harajuku, Takashita Street, and we're just gonna shop. So cute. Hey, we're here at our first vintage store. They have a lot of flannels, a lot of knits like RL knits, but nothing too special if you ask me. <laughs> but look at this corduroy. Oh my god. I think this is vintage Lee corduroy. Look at this color. It's such a cool color. The knits. Eddie Bauer knit. They have a lot of cool knits. Looks like Kugi, but it's not. But it's really nice. How much is it? Okay, that's kind of expensive. <laughs> Eight, nine. I think that's like three thousand pesos. Decently priced, long. They have a lot of cool workwear stuff as well. Lot of cool. Look at this cool denim. Parents look. My God. This is so cute, Abby. They have a lot of gorp core for like hiking. I think very uso here in Japan, hiking. 
This is authentic kugi. But how much is that in pesos? 25,000 yen. I think around 9,000 pesos. I think oh, ganun din. I think ganun din yung presyo sa Philippines, guys. So, medyo overwhelming. Okay, we're gonna check the store on top. I think sana ay good. Medyo mahal. <laughs> okay, going to the store, sa third floor. I think it's a vintage store. Let's see. More of street for streetwear. They're mostly streetwear brands, but yeah, not my cup of tea. Pero okay lang. Puro streetwear terms. Eh. Meron to sa rekto. <laughs> Parents, shut up. <laughs> Medyo fail kasi hindi ganun kaganda yung <laughs> thrift store here. Parang siya, parang siya, ano, mostly streetwear, yun nga. Parang my, my brother said it looks like you can get it from Recto. Parang meron sa Recto. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna look for more thrift or vintage stores here. Nahanap ko yung last time natin na puntahan Terrence. Yung medyo dark. Yung medyo dark. I think it's this one. Hindi ba yun yun? Parang malapit na eh. I'm trying to look for the last time, the last thrift store. I think it's this. Is it this? Oh no. It's not the same anymore. We're gonna check it out. Guys, grab it. Look at this. I don't know what you call this aesthetic, but it's so nice. Look at this jacket. Look at the studs. I don't know. I'm gonna call it Harajuku style. It's so cool. There's a lot of people. Kahit Monday. So we're having tao, guys. Guys, I'm in thrift heaven. It's so organized here in Japan, as in super organized. It's organized by style of the jacket, and yeah, super nice. As in, there's a nylon jacket, print sweats, and kanina I, I'll show you guys a race car, like NASCAR jacket, so brang ganda. They also have like upcycled sweaters. Guys, look at this upcycled sweater. Oy, kalaho upcycled. Cardigan pala kalaho ko minix with the sweat. With the sweatshirt. But look at the NASCAR racing jackets, guys. Ang ganda. Guys, nakaka-overwhelmed dito. Ang ganda here. Pero medyo pricey nga lang. As in, medyo pricey talaga. As in, usually, you want 2,000 pesos up in prices. But may mga sale naman. But, yeah, usually kagaya for guys of Philippines, but it's well organized, well chosen, as in well curated, well chosen. It's well curated, but yeah, major price talaga to be expected. But yeah, I'll show you guys along. Guys, look, look at the freaking leather jacket. Oh, it's a USS. Oh my god, how much is this? 9,790 yen. So, 3,000 pesos. That's about, that's kind of steer na. Guys, look at the overalls. As in, well organized talaga here. Pero yun nga, medyo pricey. Pero okay na, decent. 4,950 yen. That's around 1,800. No, 1,800 pesos. Perfectly okay naman yung prices. But yeah, it's well organized. Look at the blazers, guys. Guys, look how well organized talaga. Look at the trousers. Oh, ang ganda. Guys, this is like a dream. If I can make something sa Philippines na ganto. Such a cool, cool concept. They're super cool. 
As in, they have a lot of like signages para organized talaga. So you know where to buy it. Look at this varsity jacket, guys. It's literally thrift heaven. Nakita ko lang doon sa jacket sheet is I mean, guys, look so good. This is like my heaven. This is so expensive. 17,000 yen. Oh, it's Celine, that's why. Very super cool. Guys, look at the Kogi. Guys, puro Kogi here. Oh, if you guys are looking for Kogi, so rami sa Japan. That's expensive. Well, medyo same price lang. Kung magkano yung bentahan sa Philippines, ganun din. Usually 8,000 to 9,000 pesos. But here, at least, sobrang rami ng pagpipilian. So, how much is this? 19,000 yen. It's about 7,000 pesos, if I'm not mistaken. So very cool, guys. Again, I feel like yung mga gantong sweaters, very uso here in Japan. As in, even varsity jackets. I think anywhere naman. As in, uh, such good colors. So very ganda. As in, as in, so very options. So Philippines, like once in a blue moon ka lang makakita ng mga sweaters pero mas mura but here all of the colors all of the colorways so makakapili ka talaga This is the one. Ang ganda ng kimono. Kimono ba tawag dito? But I like the details here. Ay, it's small. The other one. It's too small. But really nice. Ganda. Guys, it's so overwhelming here. A lot of traditional Japanese clothes here. Eh? Pero super overwhelming as in. I don't like that one. Yun yung pangit na. Okay. It's the flat caps. Flat caps ba tawag dyan? Colors. Ito yung mga favorite namin na yun. Ito dyan. Yan better. That's nice. Pero may black na tayo. I don't know what you call it. Palos in Tagalog. Or flat cap. I feel like it's called the flat cap. Guys, look at the varsity jacket. Wow, nagma modern. Eh. We sell these things back at home. Guys, meron kaming ganyan, pero di nyo binibili. <laughs> Tas dito, 13,000 yen. Yeah. Around 5,000 pesos. Tas di nyo binibili. Sige, huwag nyo bilhin. <laughs> Ang ganda ng jacket, Abby. How much? 4,9. So like 2,000. Ang ganda na. 4.9 is 5K. mga 2.2 two, two. Uh, 1.8 1.8? Abby, that's 1.8 1.8.50 Cowboy boots guys Cowboy boots May bag siya kaya ganyan. <laughs> Blowcore heavy. Literally. So good. I've been looking for like a long sleeve na jersey. Sold na. 
guys, for 9.50 yen, around 1.8 pesos. You sold this for 600, right? Or less? You sold it for 600 pesos sa Philippines. Tapos ang tagal yung hindi pinapans. <laughs> Follower store, guys. Oh my god. So nice. Okay. How much? 4.950. Yeah. Guys, letter Letterman Cardigans. Oh, so pretty. Guys, tobacco for 12,000 yen. How much? 4,400 pesos. Tobacco. Ganda. Ah, there's Adidas jeans as well. Ganda din ang silhouette ng Adidas jeans. Guys, ang ganda ng gazelle na to. The Celtic Football Club. So nice. Parang cream and green colorway. Let's calculate mo 30. 30. Para babes na. Ito siya. 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 Ito si